and the BAFTA is awarded to Mahershala Ali for Green Book. Thank you for this, um, my fellow nominees. Thank you, thank you for your work. Um, <clears throat> you know, the, the work itself has always been the reward for me, and so it's a little surreal to get this kind of thing for something you feel so passionate about and grateful for. So, Pete Fairley, Vigo, uh, Octavia Spencer, thank you. Uh, Chris Bowers, my double, thank you. My wife and family, peace, thank you. And the BAFTA is awarded to Rachel Weiss. Hey! Thank you, Mary. Thank you, Ellen. Thank you. Uh, thank you to BAFTA for this huge honour. I had the greatest luck in that I played opposite two of the most glorious women, Olivia Coleman. <laughs> and Emma Stone. Yeah. I salute you. <laughs> Didn't we have an extraordinary time? Hats off, hats off, ladies. Um, I want to thank Yorgos Lanthimos, our director. Yorgos, your creativity is breathtaking. I want to thank the army of people that got this film made, including all of the producers, uh, everyone that stood by these three women and their story and got this film made. So thank you very much. Thank you, BAFTA. Thank you. And the BAFTA goes to Rami Malek. <laughs> This is, this is truly extraordinary. Um, really, thank you to BAFTA for this, this gorgeous gift. Uh, I still cannot believe that I'm included with this, this group of actors, actors I so respect and admire. I share this with you guys every moment. I, I, I thank my lucky stars. Um, uh, it's, it's quite difficult entering your world in this, in this role as an outsider. Um, you Brits, you do it so well, and it's not lost on me how sacred your, your musical heritage is. So thank you, thank you, thank you for including me. Uh, I, have to, I have to thank Fox and New Regency and our producers, Graham King and Dennis O'Sullivan and Dexter Fletcher and this extraordinary cast and crew that I had the blessing, um, so blessed to work with every day. I thank you. I would not be here without each and every one of you. Thank you so very much to Queen to Brian May, to Roger Taylor, to the entire Queen family. Wouldn't be here without you. And to, uh, I, I think, to, to the greatest outsider of them all, uh, 
for being so unwavering and unflinching and uncompromising in every which way. Thank you, Freddie Mercury, again. And the BAFTA goes to Olivia Colman. <laughs> I do, I do know what to say. I've actually written something down. I do know. Um, um, to my fellow nominees, to be in the same company as you is such an extraordinary honour. I think you're all, the work you all did was so beautiful. Um, very shaky, sorry. Um, can't read it either. Uh, um, all the producers, Obs, um, Fox and Element and, and everyone therein. Uh, and... Um, well, Nadia and Sandy and all of your teams, hi. We're having an amazing night, aren't we? <laughs> We're going to get so pissed later. <laughs> um, <laughs> your gosh, land from us. I, I don't know. I, I can't think of the words to thank you enough for letting me do this. My most favourite time ever. Um, the thing I really want to to do is um, Emma and Rachel must keep it together um, not just for your performances but for what you did after the camera stopped rolling <sighs> um, and we've never talked about this and I find it very emotional but um, you were the best and classiest and coolest honour guard any, any woman could ever have and I love you and Ems isn't here but we love you too Em <laughs> somewhere in America um, and oh god what else am I meant to say um, uh, I've done that bit. I think I've done that bit. Um, <laughs> uh, I, oh, and the, yeah, what I, yes. So this is, um, <laughs> sorry, I swear I'm going to go in a minute. Um, this is for, um, not for the lead, it's for a lead. And as far as I'm concerned, all three of us are the same and should be the lead. And um, it's weird that we can't do that. But um, this is for all three of us. It's got my name on it, but we can scratch in some other names. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. And the winner is... <clears throat> Alfonso Cuarón Roma. Thank you very much. Thank you, BAFTA. <laughs> um, well, uh, obviously, there's not much I would have done in this film without the amazing, amazing, amazing performances of Ma uh, Marina Tavira and Yalitza Paricio. Thank you, thank you, Yalitza and, and Marina. Um, and uh, I'm, I'm really seriously touched that this film has been received the way that it's been received. Uh, I have so many people to thank. I think I will bore you to tears now. The, uh, uh, definitely my producers, they were here. 
Gabriel speaks better than me here. And uh, wow, I'm blanking, so I better get out of here. Thank you very much. And the BAFTA is awarded to Roma. Thank you very much. Uh, well, this is uh, the people who made, well, part of the people who made Roma. This time I am going to read because as you, you can tell, I completely blanked and I don't know what to say. So um, I want to thank, of course, uh, BAFTA for, for this incredible honor, uh, Participant Media, and Netflix for having the, the faith and courage to get behind a black and white film about a domestic worker, subtitled from Spanish and Mixteco, and bring it to audiences all around the world. I share this, this award with uh, my immense cast and crew. Um, eh, this, eh, they, they, this film wouldn't definitely not exist without them. To see a film about an in, indigenous domestic worker Embrace this way in an age when fear and anger propose, uh, propose to divide us means the world to me. Retreating back to a world of separation and isolation is not a solution to anything. It's simply an excuse to hide our fear within our basic instincts. Whether we like it or not, we're all connected, sharing space and time. And when we finally choose to embrace that connection, to show compassion towards one another, we all rise together. I truly believe, truly believe that cinema has the power to help us achieve that. Thank you very much. Thank you, guys. And the award goes to Leticia Wright. I identify myself as a child of God, and I can't get up here without thanking God. A few years ago, I saw myself in a deep state of depression, and I literally wanted to quit acting. The only thing that pretty much pulled me out of that was God, my belief, my faith, my family, and an email from BAFTA saying that they wanted me to be a part of the BAFTA uh, Breakthrough Brits. And I was like, let me try again. So this, so this wasn't an overnight thing. This, didn't, this, this wasn't a click of a finger success. And it's still a work in progress. I'm still a work in progress. 
Um, but I want to just thank God. I want to thank my family. I want to thank my team at IAG, Femi, Iki, everybody at WME. I want to thank everybody that said yes to me. I want to say, I want to say thank you to everybody that gave me a chance um, and just saw my talent, saw what God placed in me and said yes. Um, I want to encourage young people. <laughs> Matter of fact, you don't even have to be young. You can be, you can be any age. But I just want to, I just want to encourage you, anybody that's going through a hard time or something in their soul or that they've lost their light, I want to encourage you that God made you and you're important. There, there might be some of you here that's going through depression, that's going through a bad time and you're putting on a smile on your face and nobody can see that, but you know it and God knows it. And I just want to encourage you and I just want to say that God loves you and just let your light shine. Um, God bless you all. Thank you so much. And the category that I'm in, the category, to be a part of this category means so much to me. I'm so honored. You guys all inspire me. Lakeith, Barry, Jesse, Cynthia, um, all of you, all of you, you have inspired me so much. So God bless you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you.